November 30th, 1043, bright sunny day, innocent people. Truck approaches from the west entrance. Mate, mate, you can't park here! 1045. Uh, I enjoyed the movie. Oh, great, very thanks. Much. It's, a very, it's a very smart movie. One thing that was very important to us was that we remain true. And by that I mean that the characters don't suddenly do a U-turn for the audience mm -hmm. and become martial arts experts on page 70. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's, they're barristers, they can only do what they can do. They're brilliant at what they do. Let's, let's explore that notion um, and have them limited by that. Claudia, we're being managed. Within six months, our client goes from driving a taxi to driving a brand new Mercedes, spending two grand a week. Where did all the money come from? I always say, hesitate to bring up biographical stuff because so much is wrong. Are, are, are you related to a judge by marriage? Is that, I am, does, yes. Does that play into any of, any of your previous it, it does, I mean, because obviously I've spent a lot of time with my father-in-law, who's a wonderful man, has the, the greatest dry sense of humour. And yes, uh, Murray was the Chief Justice of the High Court back home, he's now retired. Mm -hmm. And my sister-in-law um, is a barrister as well, so I've spent a lot of time around <laughs> lawyers. Around, around lawyers. So, which, I've, in all truthfulness, was very helpful, because there there is a, a certain level of humour and intellect that informs these characters, which you know I, I thought was essential for Martin. A lot of it was there on the page. And we have to accept all sorts of things which are simply unacceptable, and I will not accept that. You really know how to clarify a situation, don't you? I'm not even here. And thank you for your support, Mr. Attorney. We made him a little, a little slyer and a little more of a smart aleck in a previous edit, but we sort of dialed it back a little bit just to make it right for the film. Apparently, I'm paranoid. When actors make comedies or action films, it's easy to see sometimes for the audience that how much fun they're having. Mm -hmm. A thriller, Everyone's so intense all the time, it's hard to imagine this is fun, but I, I gotta suspect that probably is not the case. You're yeah, quite often that. it's it's the inverse, and in this case, you're right, we had a great time. Rebecca Hall is just a delight to work with, very funny. I want to eat my lunch. I was here first. We had, we had an absolute ball on the film, and I think sometimes, and I had this, a similar experience on Munich, as dark as that subject matter was, sometimes those sets end up being a lot of fun to work on because the the people, um, the director, the actors, you need a release valve. I'm not someone that has to stay in that intense zone all yeah. day long, and it probably comes from my comedy background. I, I can't stand that. I just it just kills me. So I, I need to jump in and out of it to kind of stay fresh and. There are over half a million closed-circuit cameras in London. I'm sure there are at least half a dozen watching me right now. You know, a movie about the government knowing everything you're doing. It is a classic, ripped from the headlines sort of a film. Absolutely. That gets released right at the right moment. Um, at what point, as, as news stories are starting to drip out, did it, did it possibly occur to you, like, oh, this is going to be perfect for us? Is there a, is there a party that, that, that's clued into current events like that when you make a movie like this? Yeah, I mean, it was interesting because it, it sort of rolled out gradually. We, we wrapped the film around May, I think May or June of last year. So a lot of that stuff was playing out while we were in post-production. And obviously the last three months have been really interesting. Uh, and we already had our date announced, so we can't be accused of trying to capitalise on that. So it was uh, somewhat fortuitous. There's good and bad sides to that. Um you hope that people still talk about the film and not just the fact that, not use it as a kind of soapbox to dis discuss everything but the film. So mm. I've, I've been on either, either side of that and had different experiences in that regard. So there can be pluses and minuses to yeah. it.